Good day, everyone. Today is 3.37 p.m. Eastern Time, and it is the 5th of February, Monday. We have a disclosure here. Today, I am not going uh, to cover those big numbers you see on the Ninja controller here. I'm not going to go through it. Absolutely, I'm not. So, because this is not going to happen every day, and the numbers are... I don't like to cover big numbers, but what I like to cover today, small numbers. What I want to cover today, I don't know what's going on in the market right now, but uh, it's jumping a lot. What I want to cover today, uh, my uh, target today with the guys are a smaller account, and I want to go uh, piece by piece uh, for those guys have a couple of $3,000 and I want it uh, to go straight to live trading. And then once we see the video on a live trading, I will start covering. What I want to target today is uh, the three range ES. And, um, and uh, what I want it immediately, we'll go through that. And let's go back uh, from the beginning this is God knows how many, the fourth or the fifth uh, times. Uh, today, we reloaded and reloaded and reloaded for the different accounts and uh, life accounts. And uh, what we are looking at in this uh, video here is the three range uh, uh, ES. And on the right uh, corner here, it is the life trade. That's why you see the chart trader is in uh, white and then on the left corner here you see uh, the the es dome is on the sim and that's why it's in the blue what i want to cover first the life trade on the three range and i want to show the traders especially the ones have a smaller amount of money they come and they over merge themselves they try to trade the cl they try to trade big accounts and the first mistake or the first trouble when they are in the market, they get in trouble. This is the between a life and a demo account. And I want to show here is on the right corner, you can see we enter the ES at 2750 on a life trade ES three range. On the left corner, we can see we have entered the, the ES exactly at 2750. The problem is there is a lot of traders they do not understand between slippage. They think it is the auto trade, has nothing to do with an auto trade, the slippage, and a limited order. And sometimes traders don't understand if they don't get filled and they get aggravated and then they take it out on all the auto trade. But today what I wanna cover piece by piece I want to start from zero with the auto trades and I want to see what is the potential on the three range. Why the three range when we just saw big numbers on the Ninja Trader controller? I don't want to cover the big numbers. What I want to cover today is a guy with a couple of $3,000 because that guy has no experience, don't understand limited orders, don't understand slippage, don't understand the market and he get pissed. And uh, today I wanted to show him which direction he can go to start with if he is a little bit more sentimental, he's not aggressive. This is what you're looking at right now. It is a life trade. On that auto trade, whether you are an experienced trader or not, you do not need to tweak the auto trade. You do not need to optimize the auto trade. You don't need to deal with a stop loss. You do not need to deal with forward testing, back testing, target uh, stop loss. You do not have to do anything. You just simply turn it on and turn it off. And that's all what you have to do to that auto trade. Now, the reason today I'm taking the three range, the three range for a smaller uh, account, uh, uh, staying being nervous, this is the most important thing, staying being nervous when you are trading. Probably this is the first time you will find enjoyment 
and they trade in. This is the first trade, and uh, I'm gonna speed it. One of the things also I like to cover that you don't need even to to interfere with the auto trade because as you see right now the auto trade come in exactly to the same entry uh, you don't need to do anything because this auto trade can really if you have some losses is going to be very small losses if we notice here we entered the market at the 2750 on the first trade and we have exit uh, uh, 28. Okay, we got to take uh, uh, one take, that's fine. Okay, this one here at the down here at the down zones. This is it was on a sim, I didn't want it, so I will. Uh, those that were closed, that were uh, we were trading live on the YM, but I wanted to concentrate on the ES and those right now. What you're looking at the YM, they are just on a sim but earlier we were trading the ym and we were done with the ym let's go to the first trade the second trade there we go we got on the second trade this is this round it happened when we started this um, uh, uh, video here we start on the afternoon session around 203 and uh, let me show go back on the second trade this is this is the second trade at 202 p.m eastern time if we can look at the second trade where it's a bit different because the market today is a jump in a bit and uh, we can see on the sim on the left sim we entered the market at the 2500 but we have one take slippage on the uh, life market with the real money so that's okay why the three range and I'm gonna show the potential today once we are looking at this video we will cover that you can use the three range ES for a guy with a smaller amount of money whether you are in um, in Europe or in Asia or in USA overnight you still can trade the three range ES and you can set a limit on it uh, your daily target or uh, your uh, uh, daily losses let's go to this uh, trade as we speak right now this is the second trade now uh, one thing for a guy with a smaller amount if you wanted to close that trade you can immediately from the top button you can say close if you are happy with a couple of three hundred dollars because it's not unusual on a three range one contract you will get a couple of three hundred one of the things this is the second one closed if we are looking at the entry is 2450 the exit and 2450 uh, the exit on the sim let's go to the third one okay we have an entry here at uh, 2 17 p.m eastern time the entry on the short is 19.25 and the entry on the life market is 1925 so we don't have a slippage so th that tells you when the market is going very fast we are going to have a slippage another things on the swing trading uh, that's what I really the main video for is if we notice here I like that part if we notice how the market almost came to the same entry and you learn the hard way or the easy way don't touch it because there is you're gonna when you see a couple of three hundred dollars on it and then you can see it's coming against you you say oh boy I wish I closed the the, the with a couple hundred dollars 
and then you will be surprised how the market take over again so if you are happy with a couple hundred dollars you see a profit couple of three hundred dollars you can go up to the buttons and then you say close position and now we are not going to trade anymore or if you want to reload your uh, auto trade you can reload your auto trade but most of the time if you leave it alone you find out you are the guy is wrong and the auto trade is the right one and let's look here so the auto trade closed this one at 17.25 and the exit was at 17.25 let's go no i'm sorry 1700 even and the second one closed at 17.25 let's go a little bit this is i think it is the third or the fourth trade and you can see it's 13.50 and then we have a slippage the market is moving a bit fast today 1375 we have one slippage and then if we're looking at this one here look the market came in and this is the accuracy of that entry and for for a guy manual trade he appreciate how precise is this entry if you can see how this market come back exactly to the same entry and then it broke down that tells a lot of stories in there and and then if we looking at it look then come back oh, okay on this one here we had one take that's fine then this is the fourth trade I think okay so this is we i will show you we have reloaded again and again and again in the live market today the three range because if you watch those previous videos uh on the last couple of three videos i insisted on the three range and today i said maybe if i cover the three range there will my traders will will pay attention to it if we look at the live trade here on the top the blue one it is the live trade and we can see how is the entry uh, and this is the sim we can see how uh, are the entries so i left uh, the the charts open and those are the ones on the top are the the ones we took a live trade today and it is exactly the same trade here let me show you because i stopped uh, uh around uh, half an hour but here are the, the trades are on the sim when we stopped those are the last trade then the auto trade took one more and then it got hit by three losing trade look but they are very acceptable and then we had a run a beautiful run here around four hundred dollars one a break even and then when the market small trade so after i closed that auto trade nailed 850 dollars and this is was i think the last trade look those are what happened on the whole chart here and we nailed the 850 on it this is the last trade right there it was a beautiful run on the last trade this one here at 1412 and entered the market at 54.25 exit at 70.25 this is a beautiful let me show you that the three range even if you are not in the state or you are an early bird in the in usa or you are overseas uh, your timing does not work with the us actually the three range is a very enjoyable 
uh, uh, to trade it with that auto trade because first of all it is a very small money when you are losing trades are very small money but you have to be as we see here sometimes you get a couple of three hits they don't work and then once this market to start trending as I said before we're gonna make money so when there is a chop market you might bump into one or two or three trades right after the others but the beauty about it the stop losses are very limited let me say so do not underestimate uh, the auto trade and we've been running those uh, three range all day long today this is where we get up in the morning to trade with the DAX you can see we had a small losing trade on the three range and then we entered the market on on um, around um, you know 5 30 in the morning uh, this is the same th the same entry folks the same entry that's why I said for the guy has a, a very small amount if this market is moving you don't need to dance with a gorilla like a CL or a DAX because if this market is trending you will be making as much money on the ES or a YM or a NASDAQ if this market is trending we are nailing it if the market is not trending we cannot do anything so what I have said on the, my previous videos on the last couple of three videos doing the Globex I'm not saying every day there is nothing in the stock market called every day but it's not unusual to see consistent every day it's not unusual couple of three hundred dollars overnight sometimes you will make it sometimes you will not make it but most of the time there is a 300 around 300 dollars overnight here at 6 56 a.m this one here is the one minute just a second this is the three range again this is the same trade it closed at 975 we were done at 715 this is before we started uh, the the afternoon market Now this is again the three range if we notice from that picture it started at 905 after we we're done with the first uh, morning run and we were done at 932 with 550 dollars this is the same ES after we are done with that target we rerun it again we started at 10 o'clock we were done at uh, 10 31 this is the fourth time at 11 31 we reloaded again and we were done at 12 24 and it uh, made 1150 and then in the afternoon run you saw it with the live trade here is some of the trades also earlier today this is the 37 377 takes this is the uh, Russell also earlier uh, this is the four range this is the ES three range I showed you this is the gold in the morning this is the CL and uh, the the trade was early also in the morning there is a lot of nice runs in the morning this is the YM that's what I said the YM we started very early we had a losing trade and then around five o'clock we get it so there is a lot of good trades uh, in the morning especially European time there is a lot of uh, good trade thank you very much and uh, God bless you all and see you tomorrow in the webinar and we will be covering more about the three range uh, and I would like my traders to start with the three range for the ones who have a small account. Thank you very much and bye for now.